Hi everyone, Sue's Journal Adventures here. <laughs> I've already been playing, I've got gluey, inky fingers. Um, right, I'm going to do a page in my journal. Just an idea for you guys, because it is a really pretty idea. I was going to do it on the last video I did, but I, I couldn't find the paper that I wanted. I haven't found exactly what I wanted, but this will suffice. So I'm going to use this. Now, normally... The last time I did this type of page, I loved it so much. That's why I want to do it again. Um, I actually properly fussy cut round the flowers. But this, there's a lot of stems in there. And I, I, I don't do stems. In fact, if I were cutting that out, I'd probably cut them off. Because it's just easier. But then that won't be tall enough. I want something kind of tall. I don't know if I like all the music in the background. Maybe I could cut it a little bit nearer but anyway um so i'm thinking i might use this i did just want a big pink rose that's what i did in the last journal well i did it in a journal ages ago and i really liked it in the last journal i did not use a decorated doily but i think i'm gonna um but i did use a book page so what i did i just basically i need to keep it on this page but it keeps flopping shut um let me put my ruler there so basically <laughs> let me move it to the side um basically all i want to do is kind of fold the, i need a page that's what you do need is a page that is wi as wide as your book page your journal page sorry um i found some more vellum <laughs> i've lost the other piece i don't know where it's gone Things really do get lost in this in this house. Right, so I'm not going to fold it because I don't want a crease. But I'm going to just try, try, she says, try and tear um, kind of a bit like a heart shape. And I'm just going to come down here. Well, actually, no, no, I'm not. So that is like the top of a heart, okay? I know it doesn't look much like a heart, but the bottom, I'm just going to now tear off like the rest of the heart, okay? And we're not going to use all of that, by the way. Um, I also, I forgot how I did it. <laughs> just let me... Oh, no, no, no. I'm not getting my journal out because it's right at the back. Right, so basically, I want to ink this. Um, and I've just got the ink out, believe it or not. Oh, do you know? I got the dauber out, didn't I? No, the dauber's gone here, well. Oh, here we go. So, what I'm going to do with this, I'm going to ink it all. Okay, it's, this is coffee dyed book page, but it's also, I think it's, has it got mica on it? Uh, yeah, I think so. So it's got a bit of mica on it as well. Not that you can really see it. And for some reason, the camera don't pick it up anyway. So um, I'm just going to come in with this um, warm lipstick. A bit pointy, these bits. but And I'm going to, kind of go to town oh i can see the mica there just going to go to town on these corner bits a little bit and here so you're doing like a heart shape but it's not going to be a heart as such um oh susan <laughs> okay i'm in my own book wow <laughs> Funny that, I just saw that stood out my name. I'm like, oh, Susan did what? She reminded me that the shade house, shade house? That the shade house cover needed to be restitched. There you go. Um, so I'm just inking that and I'm inking this. Oh, I've got to have Susan on there, haven't we? I'm going to do, oh no, I can't do the other side. It's a picture. Definitely don't want a picture. Definitely do want this now. I might be tearing some of the bottom off. So, 
the last time I did this. I can't remember what I did, but anyway. If I get the basic, that'd be good. Just want some bit more ink coming in. Bit more ink coming in. There we go. There we go. That's cool. Right now, I'm going to go back to my page, wherever that was. There it was. Yay! Um, and I'm going to stick this down at the top. Actually, do you know what I didn't do? I didn't um, measure if it's going to be big enough. Yeah, it's fine. Do I want that in or not? Let me have a look and I'll tell you. Um, get in. <laughs> um, whew, decisions. I think if I take that out, you've got dark book page, light background, but that's on quite a light background as well, isn't it? Which looks best through the camera. That looks quite nice. You know, I'm going to leave it like that. I'm just going to ink it brown. The doily does look lovely, but I just think it's too much browniness with the book page. Um, get some blooming ink on this thing. Just can't see what's going on. See, so, yeah, we're basically making a heart, but it's not a heart. It's a torn heart and it's got flowers coming out of the middle. Um, but then it's got pockets on it as well. <laughs> if I can remember how I did the pockets and where they went. <laughs> I really should have looked at my other one before I did this. But I, yeah, I think the only place I could look at it is on my phone on a photograph because I ain't taking all them journals off the shelf to get to the ones at the back. We'll manage. We'll manage. I think I sort of know how it went. I really wish I could look at it though. <laughs> oh dear. Isn't it awful when your brain just don't, don't yeah, don't work anymore properly. Right. So move that. So what I'm gonna do now, I'm just gonna trim a tiny bit of the edges of these. Because they are just a little bit too... Oh, I've just inked them all. Dear me, aren't I an idiot? I should have inked them first. I mean, cut them first. I'm probably taking a bit too much off here. No, that's fine. That's absolutely fine. And I'm just going to blather them with a bit more ink. Because I want them to look really quite pinky, these bits. Right, so you've got the top of your like heart shape, torn heart. It's just going to get some glue on this. I nearly said ink again then. Forever saying the wrong words. Right, get some it glue, glue. We'll get some glue on here. <laughs> I can't believe I nearly said it again. Not ink, not ink. So just going to put ink all over. Oh, glue, for goodness sake, brain. No wonder people think I'm a bit stupid at times, you know. <laughs> Doesn't surprise me in the slightest. Right. So I've got that, I've got that, I've got that. Cool, cool, cool. Right. That is going on there. Like so. Kind of need it near the edge, but it doesn't, I don't particularly want it to go right up to the edge. Um, and there we go. That's down. Yay. Now then, I don't know whether to stick that and then stick that over. Ah, this kind of hides my heart. The other thing didn't. Do you know what? I think I'm going to cut them big bits off. Yes, I am. Sorry. Sorry, flowers. Oh, no. She's going to cut her legs off. Oh, no. <laughs> okay. Calm down. There you go. Ink again, ink again. Oh, that looks 
weird now, doesn't it? <laughs> no, it doesn't. It looks fine. So that's going to go on there. Now then, it's this bit that's the problem because I can't remember how I did the pockets. I think, I think, did I fold it back up? And then you've got a pocket there and a pocket there. But I haven't done my heart long enough. And besides that, my heart is um yeah, well I've got this bit, so that's fine. That's absolutely fine. Um because I kind of want the right in the right way up anyway. So oh I've got brain ache. <laughs> I'm trying to see how I need the pocket. I'm just going to do it like this. It's not exactly like it was in the other book. Well, I've just got another heart anyway, whatever. So basically it was a heart and I think, I'm not 100% sure, but I think the bottom folded up of the heart that you'd torn out your page. So this covered the bottom of your page. Um but the bottom of the heart turned up and you had pockets there and there so that's what it was supposed to be like but let me stick this down <clears throat> i'm not actually a massive fan of this picture i'm probably going to regret oh, actually do you know what i don't think i'm going to stick it i'm not mad keen on that i have a pink rose that i can cut out a really big one but i just thought it might be too big but I'm actually not liking this very much. So I think I might not stick that. I might just stick this bit because that can always tuck behind it anyway. Um, hmm. And then obviously I'm going to chop this bit off and put that bit on. Actually, that bit. Right, so I need some more pink ink. Pink ink, and do I stick these flowers on? I'm not 100% sure. I think the other flower I've got is possibly maybe too big. I do have flower stickers, big flower stickers, but I don't want to use them. I did want it to be a paper flower, but let's see. I might just, you know, I might just change my mind. So if you're doing this page decoration, remember to rip your heart out of the paper and the heart becomes your top and bottom decoration. And that might need to flip back to make, see what's on the other side. Um, just let me have a look at a piece of paper I've just had out, so it's right at the top. Because um, I really like... <coughs> <clears throat> Excuse me. I really like this, but this is way too big. That's too bigger. That's really pretty, isn't it? That there. It's too small. Um, and then there's this one. But I also think that's a bit too big as well. Could just have that stood there. Oh, I don't know though. I quite like that one. Um <laughs> Ever we could find the scissors in here, the little scissors. I don't know where the little scissors are. Oh, good grief. Here, found them, found them. No, they're not them, but these will do. So I'm just going to cut this. Not properly fussy cut, or should I properly fussy? I think I don't like the music behind that other flower either. I think I don't. It, yeah, it's putting me off. Because you've got book page, so I don't kind of really want the music. These are not my precision cutting scissors, but they'll do. Just to try and get this project done quickly. Decorating book pages, so it gets like one done. <laughs> well, you know. I should prepare and I kind of thought I was prepared but you can only prepare so much because you want to show people the process so yeah and I should have thought about them flowers I thought I liked them but then I kind of just changed my mind and I'm just going to have part of that leaf I'm just going to do it like that so it looks like it's attached 
I get this stem and that's it. Whoopsie, done. Save them bits. That's better. That's mommy. I like that. Because on the one I did, it was actually a completely different advert to them that I've just cut up. And it had like, um, yeah, a few coming out now. Really lovely. <clears throat> if you've watched um, my little short video of the pink and grey journal, it's, it's a page in there that's like this with the heart. <clears throat> right, so that's it. Let's stick. Let's stick this. Now know where this needs to go. Like that, in line with that. Okay, let's stick that down. I'll chop the edge off when I'm done. When I decide, um, you know. I won't chop it off, I'll tear it off and ink it. This bit is not going to be a pocket, but it could be if you wanted it to be. Um, I don't know if in the other one I did have part of this as a pocket, actually. I think on the other one, I folded the bottom up. That were a pocket, that were a pocket. And I think I... No, I didn't. I didn't because your flower's there. Your flower's there. Okay, let's stick this on. Let's stick this on before I change my mind again. <laughs> oh, dear. Down that stalk. Right, let's get that on there. It's not really like the other page, which miffs me a bit because I really wanted it like the other page, but it's okay. It's passable and I can do more things to it. In fact, I think when I folded the other pocket up, I do believe I stuck some flowers on it and stuff. So, so this is a pocket, so I need... Just a dot of glue at the top and across the bottom. Oops. There we go. Just like that. There we go. Oh, I've covered Susan up. <laughs> oh, was Susan up there? No, Susan were on the heart bit, wasn't she? Wasn't she? She was. Yeah, so I'll fold that. And cut, tear, tear that. Not yet. I'll do it when I'm not on camera and trying to shifty everything around. So, there you go. I think this could have done with being a bit wider. I didn't tear the heart exactly properly. But I think you get the gist. And then I'm going to go in with, oops. I'm going to go in with the pink ink on the edge of my page as well. Just kind of tie it in. Get that in the other end. There we go. I'm gonna tear this off. It annoys me. I've just got I've just got to do it, you know I've just got to do it, don't you? You all know me well enough now. I'm gonna do it. I hope it <laughs> hope it tears properly. Let me get a jet page and ink. Like I say, I don't totally mind if things are sticking out a bit. Um, boy, that kind of looks a bit empty, doesn't it? See, when I did it with big flowers before, they kind of covered a lot of it and it looks so pretty. But anyway, it's in me. It's in my journal now. <laughs> it's staying. So, what I think I may do is either stamp some very light impressions in the background or stencil some light impressions. Stencil, stencil, stencil some light impressions. Did you say stencil? I did say stencil. Okay, let's get a stencil. Um, well, that's not exactly the best one to choose. But hey, I'm going to go with it anyway because pink. Oh, I pulled out the pink. Way. Uh, I've lost the ink. Where's the ink? Can anybody see ink on my desk? Where's the ink gone? I'll put it over here. Oh my days. <sighs> I can't cope anymore with this desk. <laughs> it 
it's horrid 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 right okay so i'm just gonna go for light a light bit of impression in the background i don't even know if i'm getting any impression in the background i think i am even have to do it up there don't i really let me see dun 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 oh better like that i actually like that i don't like it when there's big kind of wide open spaces and you just feel like it needs something there well it's got something there now that makes me a bit happier because i wasn't massively keen before even though i've done i'll try and dig that journal out and show you the page sometime in the future oops i'm going over it again you daft head right so there you go <laughs> that's that probably maybe just do with a tid a tiddy little leaf or something in this corner yay there we go we're all you know yeah so anyway that's another page decoration idea and these are pockets have i got anything teeny tiny to stick in there well, let's have a look. I should have. Um, and everything needs edging in pink because obviously it's a pinky page. It doesn't need edging in pink. That's just me. So I've got a little butterfly. I've got... Um, what are these? These are roses. I've got a pink rose. Oh, there you go. Pink rose on a script background that can be edged with pink. So you can go in there and then we'll have one of you in there. I wasn't going to load pockets until I'd finished, but sometimes while you're actually doing something, it's good to find things that match. So that can go in there and we need a little, maybe just a little teeny something. A teeny, what are you? Torn bit of, yeah, you'll do. You'll do. Just a torn bit of something. There you go. Um, put that up there because you'll see me rose. Then there you go. That's it. It's a pocket, but it's a, pa a pocket. It's a page decoration, but it is a pocket. Hmm. I'm feeling rose. I need a rose. I need a rose on here. Yes, I do. Do I want that one? Do I want that one? Can't see through the camera. Can I see, please? Um. Hmm, I don't know. I don't know, do I put it on? So we've got this big rose. Um, or do I just put something else on there at some point? Don't know what yet. Oh, how about a hat? Cool. out. Can't pick anything up on this day. Oh, that's a bit too... Oh, yeah, hat. And a hat. It's a bit too big. A bit too big. Um, I've got a smaller hat, but it's blue. Not, no. Right, okay, so that's that. So that's another page done. And now I've got even more mess all over my desk. But I hope you like that little idea. So the idea, basic idea is to tear a heart out of your book page. Or like two hearts. That, well, no, one heart. Because then the bottom of the heart goes at the bottom of the page. This is not as wide because I took the edges off, didn't I? Oh, I didn't tear right to the edges, I should say. But anyway, that would normally fold up and that hence makes your little pockets. But I hope you like that idea. <laughs> Thank you for watching and um, I'll see you soon with some other little things. It may be page decoration, it may not. I'm not sure if this is something that people really like watching. Um, but, you know, it all gives us ideas, doesn't it? It all gives us ideas. And I did like this page in my other journal. So, yeah, I hope you like it too. And that's it for now. I will see you again shortly. Bye for now.